This is where started the violent arrest that killed Victoria Esperanza Salazar, the 36-year-old mother of two who immigrated to Mexico so she could earn money as a hotel maid, was brutally pinned to the ground and kneeled over. As shown in the video of the arrest, she shouted and quickly appeared irresponsive. Pese cuando murió, no la identificaron, no vieron si todavía le podían ayudar, la tiraron atrás de un pickup como un pedazo de carne, como que habían recogido un perro atropellado en la calle. Eso me indignó, me duele, eso no es justo. The victim's mother has urged to bring her daughter's remains back home as soon as possible, calling for justice. Ya dieron un reporte de que a mi hija le quebraron, le quebraron, le, ¿cómo se llama? El cuello y le quebraron un montón de costillas porque ahí estaban cuatro hombres, tres hombres y una mujer sobre ella. The officers have been arrested. The local chief of police has been sacked. For protesters, this horrific killing illustrates extreme brutality against helpless people in Mexico. Aquí aparte se cruzan otras cosas que es, es mujer, es migrante y no, no es blanca, no es una persona de mucho dinero y eso hace que se ejerza una violencia que en otras circunstancias no sucede. Authorities vow to hold the officers accountable, but many protesters say police are not the only problem. Officers follow orders, and public leaders have failed to tackle police brutality, something they have promised to do for years.